Thank you for for working for us on this on this sewage stuff. I mean, it's it's been a while. It's it's coming together. Um, hey, can you speak up into the microphone? Well, turn them on. Turn it off. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, no, but I have one up there. Oh, sorry. Use your voice. Use my voice. All right. So thank you for for working with us on that. And um, there's something else. Oh, it was mentioned at the beginning. Uh, item, I don't know, Terry, $75,000. That's a bargain. The stuff she's doing with, with the, the maps, that's a bargain. So uh, I don't know where where rates come in for project managers. But that's, that's a bargain. And uh, if I swore earlier, I apologize. Uh, mm -hmm. I got over <clears throat> Hello again, Kevin Dare, 6187 Rock 88, Finleyville, PA. Uh, one of my comments is about the um, McChain Road. What, what did you call it? Race Race. Race. Yes. McChain Race. Race. Speedway. So, does anyone know what the speed limit is? The posted speed limit? 25. 25. 25. Okay. Because um, I, I just didn't know if it was a matter of the speed limit needing adjusted, but if it's at 25, then it probably can't go down from there. It's always been there. No, and it's, and it's, and I'm going to be honest with you, it's not even 6.30 in the morning till about 7.30, 8 o'clock in the morning, but on the weekends, dark bikes, quads, side by sides, 50, 60 mile an hour down. Okay. Yeah, because I was, you know, we'd heard the same complaints about uh, Brownsville Extension. And I was shocked to find out that their speed limit on Brownsville Extension is actually higher than the one on the Route 88. Yeah. So I didn't know if it was a case where, you know, maybe a traffic and engineering study could be done and, and reassess what the speed limit is or what correct, you know, procedures they could take to try and slow people down. The next thing is, is, uh, just a couple minutes ago, the, the gentleman in the back of the room um, made a comment that after two years uh, of having the sewer machine, we're finally using it. Um, and, and we have to all remember that these last two years have been unprecedented in, in the world with problems, with COVID, with mandates, with uh, fear of, of the public. And, and we have to remember that, and just because the sewer machine wasn't used in the last two years, uh, that doesn't mean that you guys or, or the road crew were not doing their jobs. It just happened, a lot of things happened in these last two years with COVID and with some of the things, the procedures and the, and, and the governmental agencies had to follow. The important thing is, is that you guys are using it now and you are addressing problems and, Hopefully it works works great and it's able to unclog some storm drains to help the people in the township. Thank you very much. Thank you. Any other public comments?